uh, the first example on projectile motion is a body is projected with velocity of 30 meter per second at an angle of 30 degree with the vertical find the maximum height time of flight and the horizontal range these things we have to calculate so given here velocity 30 meter per second theta is that is an angle of 30 degree with vertical that means theta equals to 90 minus 30 that is equals to 60 degree with the horizontal to find the maximum height reached second time of flight third the horizontal range so formula we will use first h equals to u square sin square theta by 2g second time of flight equals to 2u sin theta by g third range equals to u square sin 2 theta by g calculation from 1 that is h equals to u square sin square theta by 2g so he u is 30 square multiplied by sin square 60 2 into 9.81 so here 30 into 30 2 into 9.8 multiplied by root 3 by 2 square so sin 60 is root 3 by 2 so here the maximum height reach is 34.44 meter from formula second t equals to 2 into 30 sin of 60 by 9.81 so I will write here t equals to uh, 5.3 second now from formula third We have R equals to U square sin of 2 theta by G. So here 30 square into sin 120, 60 theta is a 60, therefore 120 by 9.81. So range equals to 79.53 meter. So the second sum on the projectile motion is a projectile has range of 50 meter and reaches a maximum height of 10 meter. What is the elevation of the projectile? Projectile has range of 50 meter and reaches a maximum height of 10 meter. What is the elevation of the projectile? So here given range 50 meter maximum height is 10 meter 
to find elevation of the projectile formula first we will use range equals to u square sin 2 theta by g second we will use h equals to u square sin square theta by 2g calculation we have to find out elevation of the uh, projectile that is theta we have to find out so dividing formula 1 by 1 so we get h by r equals to u square sin square theta by 2g multiplied by g divided by u square sin 2 theta so simplifying u square sin square theta divided by 2g into g divided by 2 u square sin theta into cos of theta so here sin 1 sin cancel so i am getting here u square u square cancel so i am getting here h by r equals to 1 by 1 by 4 tan of theta so tan theta equals to 4h by r therefore theta equals to 4 into height is 10 range is 50 therefore theta equals to tan inverse of 4 by 5 so i am getting theta equals to tan inverse of 0.8 so here theta equals to 38.66 degree that means elevation of the projectile is 38.66 degree body is thrown with velocity of 49 meter per second at an angle of 30 degree with horizontal find maximum height attained by it time of flight the horizontal range so body is thrown with velocity of 49 meter per second at an angle of 30 degree with horizontal find maximum height attained time of flight and the horizontal range so given things u is 49 meter per second theta is 30 degree to find maximum height time of flight horizontal range formula is h equals to u square sin square theta by 2g time of flight equals to 2u sin theta by g and range r equals to u square sin 2 theta by g calculation from formula 1 
एच इक्वल्स टू फोर्टी नाइन इंटू फोर्टी नाइन इंटू साइन स्क्वायर थर्टी बाई नाइन टू इंटू नाइन पॉइंट एट सिंस साइन थर्टी इज वन देर फोर फोर्टी नाइन इंटू फोर्टी नाइन इंटू वन बाई टू इंटू नाइन पॉइंट एट बाई वन बाई टू so into 4 so here h equals to 30.625 meter then from formula 2 t equals to 2 Into forty nine into sine thirty by nine point eight. So here I am getting two into forty nine into one by nine point eight into two. So t equals to five second. Then from r equals to 49 into 49 into sine 60 by 9.8. So here 49 into 49 multiplied by root 3 by 2. So range equals to 212.2 meter. Thank you.